Okay guys, this is the Shogren Initial Factory Review. Okay. Now you can, um, just to start things off, you can hit fire with this gun. I wouldn't recommend doing it to 10 meters, 10 meters or under. That's where you need to start hit firing. So this is about 10 meters right to that wall. So anything under that you can hit fire, I would recommend. But anything over that, aim down sight because this gun is not very good at damage. But it can one shot people, but it's very difficult. But it has a very high rate of fire to boost itself up. God, that almost was my death. Almost was my death. Okay, this guy's almost dead. Oh, generator room. Where should we go? Okay. I think the generator room is gonna be a really big choke point. Oh, it already is, but, you know, even bigger. What? At least one of those bullets, pellets, I'm going to call it pellets. Hit him. Uh, man, this gun is pretty good, though. I like it very much. I unlocked this gun like in one round. It was super easy. It was front lines. Got 75, no, 76 kills. I got 15 with the, um, whatever it's called. And then, um, 50 with the. Oh, wow. I thought that was gonna get a kill. But the, the 10A slug. Hey, can I get a revive, everybody? Yes, thank you. Oh crap, there's a little bit many of them. Oh, we're surrounded. We need to get back. Hey, buddy. We are losing we're getting the, they're capturing the barracks. We need to stop them. Oh man. Automatico. Those automaticos, God. You can't fight against those things. <sighs> I still love the Automatico, it's just, you know, I just feel like it's just too OP. Just practicing my aim. That shot did not make it. I'm just saying, y'all, if you want a guaranteed one shot, use the 10A. This is more for one shot, two shot area. It's not the... Go, 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 oh. Wait, does this, um, this gun have a bayonet? No, it doesn't. We have lost objective Edward. I wanted it to have, um, bayonet. 
I think this is one of the only uh, shotguns that don't have a bayonet. Oh my god, they all came for me. Okay, this shotgun is not very good outdoors. We're not gonna take it outdoors. So, you gotta keep it inside Fort DeVoe. Not out. No, Fort DeVoe, not Fort DeVoe. I think it's just Fort DeVoe. I don't know, I'm having a little debate inside my head. Is it Fort DeVoe or Fort DeVoe? Really? He saw me? Uh, I could barely see him. I could just make out that there was an enemy there. It's definitely not our friend. We have lost objective. Mm. Breakable wall? No, I don't think so. It's the other wall. Don't worry. I got it. There you go. Oh. I did not see him. I'm burning! Let's tag him from behind. How can I get damage from, uh... Hey, I'm just gonna play with this for just a little while. Don't... Yeah, you know, I've just been really... Wanting to play this gun, so I'm just gonna... Play it for right now. There we go. He's not gonna be coming towards me. Oh yes he is. Oh yes he is. Crap. Oh, he has a gasser, really? What kind of style do you have? Four freaking hell. I think that was that same guy who I just took his gun. Really? My kill death ratio. Well, it's also because I'm, for some reason, starting to become a noob again. I need to practice this game again. Because I haven't been playing it much this week. Sacrifice was I gonna kill the assault player or killed the support player and I think I chose the one that was right Just saying because if the assault player knew I think it would be I would have less a chance of living Oh my freaking god We have taken objective dust Uh-uh, I'm not dealing with that crap. I literally, that's a spawn kill. Oh, here's the area that I was looking for. Can you hear zombies? Oh, I'm not wasting my time. Enemy has the upper hand. 
Cool. I bet you call this one. Dead, right? Yep. Let's move on. Oh, I wish you could blow up those fuel tanks. Let's get the breach. Oh, this is, must be the ammo room. Okay, let's go in. Breach. Okay, we gotta get out of here. Oh, he has a show shit. Which is a really good gun if you use it correctly. They're getting the generator room. We have taken objective Ed. Oh. Crap my accident, I just pulled my finger on the trigger. We have lost objective apples. He's dead, definitely. Had uh, that way, or going back and get blown up. I had no choice. <sighs> also, I hurt my neck today, so. Kinda aggravated by that. Shot right there. We have lost objective Charlie. A lot of grenades, you see, a lot of grenades. 
Not much has changed about the grenade. Oh, brick. through that corner right there. Let's watch that. Lock. We have lost objective dark. Okay. Where do we go now? I feel like we should go I feel like we should go for D. Hmm. Ah, uh, he interrupted my my little kill streak. Okay, so let's go for D. <laughs> it's called the Ribby Royale or Ribby Rolls, I don't know. That's another debate. <laughs> Great. Okay, I think we're getting D, so they have the same idea as me, so. Go. Oh. Watch out. Oh, show chat. I haven't trained with the show yet because I don't have it really. So I don't know this gun well. Red of fire isn't that bad on this gun. As everyone says. The sight on this is pretty good. Yeah, I like it. The French gun sights are really good. Oh, he has his recoil pushing to the left, and I don't like that. At all. Whatever. I like it pushing to the right. Gun. Oh, I got another sh trophy. Match her right down. And it's a gold trophy. Okay, I like this gun. I'm getting like just a little trailer for my real experience with this. Okay, get back. Now this gun sight's extremely accurate. That's why I like it. I like his choice of pistol though. 
It's the Rick Ryan's um, pistol. Way. Okay, let's get barracks. Which is D. I heard him coming. He's still there. Oh, I thought he didn't see me. And I almost got that kill. Whatever, this is supposed to be the choker room. Um We have taken objective Edward. Uh what's it called? Inertial factory review. So I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, nice. Except all my teammates are almost dead in there, so I gotta retreat. I hear someone behind me. Oh, he's not a friend. this shotgun it's just somehow really good okay I don't like that okay this is gonna be the end of the game any last words Nice, we got the feet. But I, the, I was saying nice because I got a good, um, good score, and that I got pretty good kill death ratio. Let's see, yeah, pretty good. So that's gonna be the that's the Shogarin Inertial Factory. I give it um, about uh, what would I give it? I'll give it a 9.5. Okay, here's the ups and downs about this gun. The up is that it has a very good fire rate. Um, it's pretty easy to get killed with it. Um, reloads pretty fast. Nothing that good. Here's the bad. Now, the bad's pretty big, but it somehow is pretty good. So the bad is um, no bayonet, which is pretty good for some people, but that's not the big deal. It's um, that it's pretty hard to get um, a one-shot kill like that. So with hit fire and all that. So that's what I gave it. Okay, now please like, subscribe, and see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Ah,